Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I was scrolling through like YouTube the other day and I watched a video of Alicia Marie's. It was her working from home like tips or whatever. I can't exactly remember the title of the video. I then got a video of hers in my on my homepage recommended and it was of her Coachella outfits. So I thought why not look at her Coachella outfits and pick out the good points, the bad points, my opinions on them. Obviously everyone has different fashion tastes and so what I say about one thing might be different for someone else. Like I might find something really cool, someone else might find it ugly. That sort of thing. But I hope you guys enjoy and let's just get into the video. So I checked Instagram first because I wanted to see like whether she'd done like any like pictures of them all to make it I guess easier for me to look at but I'm just gonna watch through the video I'm gonna try and put up screenshots of all her outfits and all of that let's just watch and criticize roast comment on that sort also before you we get into what she wore or what she would have worn don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you've maybe if you're maybe new to my channel you've never seen my face before because i know that 50 percent of you aren't subscribed and that means that 25 to 50 of you aren't subscribed so make sure you hit that subscribe button down below what are you waiting for but anyway let's just get into what okay so i've just watched the, the video the first part of the video and this is her first outfit but honestly like this outfit looks so insane i'm loving like she just pulls off that vibe so 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 well like you i wouldn't wear like the cowboy like scarf or whatever it's called but she pulls it off insane like i could never rock what she wears honestly like it's edgy it's like cowboy I and mean, it's like it's just insane the studs they just make it like it's not just plain black it's studs plus the zips like oh that's it gives me like james charles vibes and obviously i know she included like a picture of the james charles like last year but honestly it was like james charles vibes and like i don't know how she finds all this stuff but honestly like I'm envious, like, she looks insane in her body, her clothes, and she just looks insane. Also, like, that chain, like, that went around, that also makes it, like, it complements the scarf as well. I don't find a fault, I can't find a fault with it. Cannot find a fault with it. So, let's move on to the next outfit of hers. <laughs> this look is going for, like, those neon vibes. I really like the joggers and the shoes. The top, personally, is a little bit too low cut for me. Like, it works for her and, like, it covers her up. I'm more of a, like, not a covering it all up, but a little bit more coverage. But, again, her vibes pulls it off. That bucket hat. I love like the vibe she's going for with it again mentioning the shoes wouldn't be my usual style but they do look cool like the color awesome the bit on the ankles that's the thing that's a bit like weird for me but again goes really well with her look and then the belt I don't go for that like really long belt in fact I own one belt from Primark Honestly, she just has this cool vibe. It's like an LA vibe. She lives in LA. She has this vibe and it's like a lot of people in LA can like pull off that sort of look. And again, her like her figure, it looks insane. I can't find any criticism to it. Like it is so, so cool. And I like how she's got like contrast between like the yellow and the pink. It works so well because sometimes like having the same colour, it, because it's like matchy matchy, it's a bit too much, but she's got that colour contrast and it's awesome. Okay, so with her third one, she did actually post it on Instagram, so it's going to be a whole lot easier for me to show you, so this is it. She's gone for this like simple like black crop top 
crop a crop tank is that what it's called i don't know and then it's just some like shorts and like high like ankle boots a little like a little bit like top martens but with like the white but with white laces and without the yellow trimming but honestly like so and also like she's got the chains so so like the belt is a bracelet and like i think it's like a bracelet of like a necklace or whatever like it just pieces together so well and like those accessories like they complete the look and also the hair her hair looks stunning it's just something simple obviously the photo i put up is photoshopped clear to see I didn't notice it when I was scrolling through her Instagram though, so <laughs> like I wasn't paying attention to the fine detail, I just thought, oh, nice outfit. But honestly, she just looks insane. That you it's like a classic look. You can't go wrong with like the shorts, like the Doc Martin type boots and that like like that strappy crop top. Like it's just a simple put easily easily put together a vibe outfit type thing and then She's made it like coach yellow vibes with like the chains and it just looks insane. Honestly, it looks insane. I'm just watching like the last bits of the video and I like the belt. It's a clear belt, so it's hard to tell on the actual photo. Honestly though, like the belt looks so good. Like not my vibes. Also the skirt has like a slit in the side. Again, like and she's got shorts and underneath thought i'd mention that and it's just such an awesome outfit and that see-through belt in a normal everyday today would be deemed unnecessary but for coachella it is everything like it is so cool and it's like that it's like a waist trainer but like acrylic also like the slit and the skirt like just that extra details like with Coachella outfits you can put on something like so simple but that jewellery the accessories like the little extra details make a Coachella outfit and honestly like insane like none of these outfits I would wear because I'm not that confident she rocks it like the Coachella vibes are Wow. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to smash a massive thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. Comment any videos you want to see from me and also share this video if you liked it and you thought it was interesting. And I will see you guys in my next video.